Hey guys, Dan from World of Mr. Grey, Dan Delft the Bloody Grey, and what did I say? What did I say? <laughs> this is only going to be a short one, but I, I, I wasn't going to make a video today, but I saw a thumbnail from Slap Time and I thought I gotta, I gotta have a look because it, it looked bloody familiar to me. Do you remember about a month ago when I, I made a debunking video on that guy who gets pulled in the gym? when he's doing his stretches and he gets pulled by a good unseen force. We just figured out it was just him doing it himself. But I said in the video, give it three weeks and you will see another a hundred other bloody videos doing the exact same shit. Now, it's been more than three weeks and I was having the odd comment. I can't remember who it was. A few people said, well, it's been three weeks and still no video like that. <laughs> well, <laughs> I saw the latest thumbnail from Slap Time. I watched the entire video. I just went dire directly to this video because lo and behold, Mario Lara, you know him, you know who he is. Mario Lara himself has posted a video of a woman getting pulled. So let's have a look, shall we? Ah, oh, it's brilliant. So the video starts with a girl rumbling through a box and then she gets pulled by an unseen force. Now, she's not using her own um, movement and physicality like the gym goer was. But she gets pulled. And then you see a little wobble in the camera. I think it's supposed to be the ghost mess with the camera. But I think it's just giving the person up in the distance time to get back. And it's just hidden a transition. It's hiding a transition so the guy can walk behind the camera. It's like, oh, what was that? What was that? <laughs> well, let's have a look, shall we? If we watch her go... Frame by frame. There are very various instances where you can see the string. Now hopefully I've pointed this out. Because I've literally just gone from work now and I literally just started looking at that uh, footage where I can see it already. Keep an eye on her foot. In various parts of the video, you see a little glimpse of something by the side of her foot. What's that? You can also see it there. Again, hopefully I've zoomed in and squared it. <laughs> you can see all kinds of uh, masking techniques around the foot. Like I said, I said this many times, when you know what you're looking for is obvious. You can also see the string again or something. There's something attached to her leg. It's just being, um, remember how I said how to use the wire removal tool? And you see something there as well that they haven't masked out. gets up and runs away and as she does by the way there's all kinds of artifacting going around going on around her because because they haven't used the wire removal tool to um wipe it out i'm probably not going to call this a full debunking but i can see the strings i've pointed them out and like i said this isn't a full debunking one but it to me is plainly obvious and then the transition is to hide the fact that the guy was probably up in that distance pulling her along and then they hit the transition so it gave him time to go back behind the camera and come out and say, what was that? What was that? As I, as I said in the previous video I made just before this, the masking tutorial and why it's not a ghost, it's a fixed camera. You can do all sorts of masking techniques and it's exactly what they've used by there. Like I said, I'm not calling this a full debunk. To me, it's plainly obvious. But yeah, it was more than three weeks, but I said, I bloody said, that <laughs> after that gym one, because that went viral, you'll see a, a load of other people doing the exact same shit. It took a bit longer than three weeks, but they finally happened. It finally happened. But anyway, that was an extremely short video because I just wanted to show that. <laughs> I was bloody right. But let me know in the comments what you think. Do you think I'm full of shit? Do you think you can see the string and the mask in techniques in that video after you watched my tutorial video on a fixed camera position? But anyway, I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like if you like this video. Leave a sub if you're new to my channel. I do these quite often. And that's it. We'll just wait for the other video. And yeah, anyway, thanks for watching. Bye for now.